Well, I looked at the slate a couple of days ago. I've been on, on travel for about a week and a half. And when I seriously started looking at it, I was like, wow, this is a phenomenal slate of candidates. Uh, so I'm, I'm truly honored to, to be among uh, this group. Uh, a little bit about myself. Um, I'm a local product. I actually graduated uh, from high school in Fairfax County. I went to George Marshall High School, believe it or not, just around the corner for a couple of years. Uh, graduated from Virginia Tech in electrical engineering. Uh, went on to do a master's degree in systems engineering. And that might have been the best degree or best uh, two years uh, that I spent. Um, everything we do in our environment is all about systems, right? It's never about technology alone. Um, and I've had a wonderful career so far. I've worked with uh, a, a large telecom carrier, um, spent many years in GTE, uh, worked for two or three years, two and a half years with uh, MITRE. So I got a pretty interesting perspective on uh, CETA uh, and how the government operates on the other side of the fence. Uh, worked for a multinational company, CSC, you guys have all heard of them. Uh, and very acutely aware of uh, the challenges of bringing commercial technology into the uh, federal government environment. Um, did a startup. Um, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm back working because I didn't hit a home run. <laughs> um, did not do a successful IPO, but uh, launched a small company uh, called Mobile Helix. Uh, um, was a CEO, and I tell you, no degrees in the world can actually give you that kind of experience. Uh, and, and learning how to fail uh, and taking care of your employees at the same time and, and you know, getting a soft landing um, is a different experience. And I was able to parlay that and bring that back into uh, government contracting, uh, working uh, for CSC for about six, seven years. And now we're actually a five and a half billion dollar startup, which is CSRA, combination of the public sector of CSC merged with uh, SRA International. So that gives you the sort of the diverse perspective that I will bring uh, to the table. Uh, life is all about perspectives. Um, CS, CS, CSRA is very much a, a service provider. Uh, we don't make any products. We don't have any technology of our own. We rely, our lifeblood, if you will, is, is the partner ecosystem. Um, so my job today is really working very closely with our small vendor uh, uh, partners, technology vendor partners, small businesses, uh, and other folks that sort of come together to bring that systems engineering approach to, to solutions. And I think part of what I'll do is bring that technology focus to the table and, and the influence of the entire ecosystem that we're building around our partners and bring a lot of folks to join ACT-IAC. I've had uh, a lot of contributions in, in um, uh, various groups, including ACT-IAC, but more importantly in, in leadership roles at Tech America. I've been on the board of directors there. Um, I've, uh, I sit on uh, the uh, advisory board at Louisiana Tech University uh, on their College of Engineering and Science. So I have an academic angle there in terms of what the next generation workforce needs to uh, be and how we embrace them into our workforce. Uh, and I've, I've worked extensively at PSC and, and also at um, uh, NVTC. So those perspectives are what I expect to bring and I ask your vote to give me the opportunity to serve. Thank you.